Hi, I'm Randy Bombosi, and I am here with Greg Carlisle, who is running for a two-year spot on our city council. Um, thank you so much for coming and meeting with me. I appreciate it. You bet. We'll just go ahead and jump in with a few questions. The first one I wanted to ask you is, why are you running for city council? I am running for city council because I feel I can make a difference with uh, the uh, efficiency of city council uh, to help them uh, consistently uh, be accountable for decisions they make. Uh, I, I want to bring the rule of law back, uh, uh, the uh, systems and processes of everything that the city should be doing. Um, you know, I want to make uh, transparency, accountability, and the rule of law, <laughs> and uh, things the way they should be. Uh, uh, I feel like I can make an influence there with Kaysville City, um, uh, from what I understand with uh, uh, some things that could be done differently, and that they're doing some things great as well. Mm -hmm. Sounds yeah. great. Um, what is your background? Are there things that you feel that you can bring to the council to add to this discussion or help the city forward? Well, uh, as far as background professionally, 20 years ago I got a uh, degree in technical sales. Doesn't sound like a real degree, but it is. Uh, from uh, Weber State and used that for eight years. The uh, recession hit, had to get creative, lift up concrete lifting, uh, sub contractor which is contractor over on Angel Street um, and uh, uh, some education in contracting as well and I've been doing that for uh, about a decade now so that's my professional background uh, and uh, politically the only thing I've ever done is be comprised of the issues and vote up until now <laughs> That's wonderful. Um, are there any issues in the city that you're concerned about, specific things that you want to focus on? I know you've talked about transparency and the rule of law. There was something else in there. but Accountability. Accountability. That's a good one. Is there, there anything go. else that you want to focus on as you look at serving on the council? Well, I do know uh, I've, I was personally affected by uh, Kaysville City. Uh, with a, uh, the Angel Street Safe Sidewalk Project with intention of getting that uh, sidewalk in. And I was on uh, Channel 5 News. And uh, when I was on Channel 5, I received many, many calls about uh, things that could definitely be done differently with uh, Kaysville City, just in private property rights, uh, condemning properties versus just taking uh, takings. Uh, uh, one, two, um, uh, I've, I've heard some things about uh, zoning and how zoning, I believe, from what I know, should be more of a, uh, a vote versus a staff decision with the city. Uh, I've also heard about uh, uh, essential or non-essential things that the staff side of the city or, you know, management that makes a living with it can make uh, versus uh, uh, the people vote on essential or not essential of where to spend money. So uh, f these are pretty big issues from the people I've been talking to. <laughs> and the rules are always clear and the law is always clear, uh, but we, we just gotta make sure that that's always followed uh, consistently. Um, so I believe that answers your question of Wonderful. a few top issues. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much for coming and answering a few questions for me. And for anybody watching, the ballots will be mailed out in the middle of July. Those yes. should be hitting your mailboxes and collected through the end of July. And then the decision for who will move on to the primary election will be made in the beginning of August. So that's look right. For that. Again, I'm Gregory Carlisle running for two years. Wonderful. Thank you thank so you. much, Greg.